Well, Mr. Figgy Boy. Fear is weakness. I never feel fear. Fear is weakness. I never <laughs> feel fear. I'm a jumpy <laughs> bean. I'm a jumpy bean. The headmaster is hated as black. It's good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today before you immersed yourself in studies. You're stuck. Did I, I saw you outside my bedroom window Professor last night. Weasley talking about exploring ruins? I hope I didn't show too much. She caught me off guard. I didn't tell her anything else about our travels here. I will say, I think she suspects we're not being entirely forthcoming. Yes, well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It may Probably require a bit hell. more flexibility with your time than she would approve of. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Understood, Professor. <laughs> Good. He wants now, him to keep as secret. capable as you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges stuff. you, you to be well trained. Happily, you have the benefit of an bad, exceptionally skilled naughty. team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another not-so-subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guide's map? Unfold it and have a look. Unfold it and have a look. Oh my god. Okay, I don't understand. What am I supposed to do? The map is enchanted to help you find your way. This will be incredibly well, helpful. Great. Thank you. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead, with I'm classes and a trip to Hogsmeade so for supplies, including your own wand. You'll enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an exceptional craftsman and a good friend. I shall reach out when I have more information about our mysterious locket. For now, focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these Lots walls. Of secrets. That's never a good thing. Run, horse, well, run. Get rid of all the Muggle-born students. Too much to hope for, I suppose. I thought about transferring to both Battens just to get away from Professor Black and his iron horse. Will lead you to anything you're tracking. Well, that was stupid. The fuck, Farzy? <sighs> well, that's just weird. So, no door. Never forget about that, Opal. Oh, run, Forrest, run. Oops. The fuck? Ah, oh, fuck. No, I don't. No, I don't. Do I? What time is it? I don't know, man. I don't know. Fuck it. Stupefy! Stupefy! Is that all you've got? Uh. Bombarda! Levioso! Professor Hackett! Perhaps you'd be good enough to blast each other to pieces on your own time. I get new students every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. It was a token from the great poacher raid of 1878. No doubt you've heard of it. Nope. Now, you may be asking yourself how an old woman like me single-handedly took out the largest poacher ring in eastern Wales and lived to boast about it. Knowledge. Knowledge is power, man. To the wise, age matters very little. Today, we will review a spell that has saved me from death at the hands of dark wizards more times than I care to remember. Levioso. Levioso? A levitation charm? Levioso! Ah! A surprised opponent is a weak opponent. Care to defend yourself, Master Pruitt? No? No. Because he's a little wanker. One thing I've learned as an unspeakable is the value of simplicity, especially in the heat of battle. Now, Let's practice what we've just learned, starting with something small. You! Let's levitate you out the window! Ah, uh, fuck! Hmm. 
Woo, I did it first time. Yay, the 7,000 times I failed in other ones. Woo, levitate a feather, man. Now, let's try something a little larger. Where's Leviosa? Leviosa. But where did it go? I don't know where it went, man. Let us begin with a basic cast. See how the dummy deflected your cast? This time, cast Levioso first, then the basic cast. Remember. Levioso. Good. Now, well done. Well, he's such a good one. Very good. But the best way to practice is by dueling. We'll start with you two. Duelists, take your marks. Time for a proper Hogwarts welcome. Now, <laughs> I want a fair duel using only Levioso, basic cast, and Protego. You may begin. Levioso, this Protego. Be easy. Protego complicates things. You're good. How perceptive. Good form. I know. <laughs> Lucky. Le Nothing lucky about it. This could be your Levioso. Let's just say I'm a quick learner. I do enjoy a lively duel. Punk kid. Not bad for a beginner. You give as good as you get. <laughs> you gave me nothing. Jerk. <laughs> you little. I monkey. put you on the spot and you rose to the challenge. Points to Gryffindor. Thank you, Professor Hackett. Glad to have the opportunity to practice. If what I've seen today is any indication, we can expect That's great things, things from, from you. you. I demand excellence from my students. They are capable of achieving it, and they must achieve it. A classroom duel is one thing, but battling dark wizards, or as ever more likely, goblins, is a different kettle of Grindelow's entirely. Understood, my Professor. Eat my so, I'd advise you to keep practicing whenever you can. Perhaps Mr. Sallow will have some ideas for you. Again, well Swallow. done today. I shall reach out soon with additional assignments. Well, that's great, thanks. All right, that's enough spectacle for one day. Class is dismissed. Nice work. Oh, this is Swallow. I enjoyed that. Well, that duel was quite something. Everyone will be talking about it. It was certainly good practice. Practice? It felt more like I was dueling an expert. Sebastian Sallow, by the way, didn't expect a new student to be so deft with a wand. Then well, again, I've had time perhaps to this wasn't my your wand. first duel. And Mr. Figgy. In fact, it was. Perhaps I have a knack for it. Be coy if you like, but I know better. Magic requires intention and talent. You know... You might be a perfect fit for a certain exclusive, unsanctioned dueling organization. Exclusive and unsanctioned? Count me in. Excellent. Knew I was right about you. If you want to get the most out of your time at Hogwarts, you're going to need to break the rules now and then. Whether it's joining a secret dueling club, or sneaking into the restricted section of the library. Oh my God. You just have to be clever so enough talking, not to get so caught. Talking. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll keep that in mind. Good. Pleasure chatting with you. I'm sure I'll see you soon. Perhaps somewhere unsanctioned? We'll see if your performance today was sheer luck or actual skill. Look for Luke and Brattleby near the clock tower entrance. If you're interested. Luke and Brattleby? Till next time. Till next time. Ooh, I'm level two. I don't want to go to charms class yet. Where the fuck is that? What is that? Ooh. 
Run, first run. You gotta get the clack, boy. My friends and I lose Run, ah, I don't know where to go. That looks suspicious. Did he try to touch my penis? I think he tried to touch my penis. I cannot do this for all eternity. Yes, you can. Oh my god, I'm so busy. I gotta run. Run! Professor Ronan tends to go on a bit. We sometimes have to remind him to finish the lesson. Some of us don't class. necessarily want him to get back okay. to the lesson. Okay. That must be it. <laughs> 